in Africa. But this time, after the group, the group stages, we have, we have had, we have also still, as you were saying, the tradition is still there, dominating. As in the quarterfinals, we have four Maghreb, four uh, northern northern Africans clubs. Is the, is it this meaning that the clubs? They, they, of course, we are seeing new uh, nations emerging, but the clubs, some of the clubs even disappeared. The, the, the old tra the clubs disappeared, but we are still having the four, the four teams from North Africa. What do you think about this? Um, you know, for example, um, it's all about investment yes. in football. Uh, traditionally in Africa, uh, especially beginning from the 70s, 80s, going to the 90s, much of the investment in football was done in North and West Africa, really? where they would have um, 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 small clubs or they would have um, 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 centers, sports centers, nurturing young players. And then those players would be, uh, um, um, in time, they would develop and going to play for their own club teams and later to the national teams. So without being the case in East and South Africa, we didn't inv in Southern Africa, we didn't invest much. And yeah. also Central Africa, we didn't invest much in football. Yeah. So with that being the case, I'm not surprised seeing out of eight teams, four, four are coming from North Africa. There's a club, for example, like Enimba, which used to I, be that, a power. That's, what, that's my question. My question is, <laughs> where has gone these giants? Enimba, Ashanti Kotoko. What are these teams? <laughs> I don't really, I don't see them, and uh, I'm like teams uh, like uh, uh, this young Africa, the young Africa from 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 uh, from Tanzania. These teams, where have they gone? What is happening? Because if you are seeing the, the defending champion Esperance of Tunis is there, mm -hmm. uh, Waidad Casablanca come, came back, El Alahiri come back, and the, we have even a new a new from Maghreb, uh, the Horayo, uh, Hor Horoya FC from from uh, Guinea. from uh, Guinea. Mm -hmm. So now those teams, where have they gone? Um, as I said before, football is changing rapidly. Really. Right, right. So the traditional names they are going because. Football is played in the pitch. Yeah. It's not played by words or history. So many people are working to beat history because the previous history was written by the winners, yes. but now the new history is written by the emerging teams. True. Yes, we had those Enimba and whatever, but if they are not doing their thing on the pitch, then what happens? We'd have other teams which are working out. For example, see a team like Tipi Mazembe. Where? They have invested a lot of money into their, 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 their system of bringing up pray everything. prayers, having a good stadium, and we are seeing the fruits. It's they really? are working out very yeah. well. They even went to the uh, club, uh, World Club World Cup. Club. And uh, yeah, even though they lost, but at least they showed the strength. Seriously. That when you invest much, especially to the young generation, under 17, under 15, it pays off because in five, seven years, those players will be having 22, 23 years and they will be playing very well. Anyway, in